Welcome back to this cassette game of the women's tournament. This is a women only tournament. So here on the south we have Duckhead playing as the Holy Roman Empire and on the north we have Artemis playing as the English. Interesting that we see Artemis immediately starting off with those, um, with those farms and I've got somebody who can help me determine why it is. We've got Nim here. Hello. Hello, everyone. <laughs> what, would, what do you think about the strategy of starting out with farms immediately as the English? I mean, as English, it's fine. Uh, it doesn't cost you a whole lot. Mm -hmm. um, it's it's not that difficult a choice, right? Like, you're just getting a lot of value out of those farms. And if other, if other factions could do it, if they mm -hmm. could afford to, then they would as well. But they cost 75 out of the top of my head for for like any other civilization mm -hmm. and they cost um what's that like 37 mm -hmm. for, for yeah English? yeah yeah the okay just missed a, a sheep but we did miss <laughs> a sheep didn't we yeah i saw it but obviously she's probably not 100 percent another one there oh no she saw that one. no nope. <laughs> that one got picked no, up no, no, she she was thinking to come back for that <laughs> later, but Artemis, Artemis was stupid. actually yep. in the fog of war right here. <laughs> Let's take a look at what Artemis' scouting path looks like. Okay, she, pretty far. I mean, she doesn't have to go back quickly because she has those farms. It's true. So it's she true. does have some more time <clears throat> to run around. That's one of the advantages of of, uh, of being English and then taking those farms out early, mm -hmm. right? It's like you, you don't need to be back home on time with your scout to really um yeah be in time for to really be in time for it like before the sheep run out and you're out of food yep. because that's always that's always a bad time <laughs> well, at least you did it back now <laughs> um this is the can i say that the third game uh no this is the second game. we're doing the second now yeah this is the second game are we doing a third game um <laughs> Yeah, we could. <laughs> we if, could. If you're up to it. If uh, you're up to it. Sure. Oh, Artem is <laughs> really looking to get that that kill on the the scout, and like they're already half health. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like two two volleys like that, and they're done, right? Like it's yeah. very it's very scary sometimes. That's that's the scary thing about getting so close to, to an English, to an English town, town center. center. Definitely. Um, I don't know if these are. I'm just gonna assume that these are gonna be uploaded in 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 order. Then. Uh, yes, uh, but I'm gonna do my best to do that <coughs> duckade and artemis hey artemis where there's another sheep there um are are battling it out she was placing the, the council all down are battling it out on on uh women the women tournament mm -hmm. so uh we're gonna see be seeing more of these i don't know in which order they are in um but we're gonna you're gonna be seeing more of these on on, on yeah. the channel and we uh I'm gonna try and see if we can we can cast some more of these games because honestly they've been they've been pretty exciting. Yeah, the the women tournaments is just really cool. I just like the fact that we have this tournament with only women in it. Oh, uh, it's so cool. It, yeah, it's just so great to see everybody unite like that. It's so cool. Uh, we've got the Aachen Chapel coming up for our Holy Roman Empire player. This boosts gathering speed or something. It goes. Right? It, it, it boosts. It boosts <laughs> gathering speed. Yeah, yeah. So the Perfect. prelate here mm -hmm. has this thing called Holy Inspiration, right? Yes. Which increases village ge uh, villagers gathering rate by 40%. Now that's significant. Yeah, that's that's really yes. significant, right? I think you'll agree with me. That's really significant. But he can only hit so many villagers at a time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I believe up to eight. I I don't quite know. I think these were already more than... These are more than eight. And I think he was boosting them all already. Hmm. Um, but the Aachen Chapel obviously um, uses that same boost, but then in a larger radius. Yeah. So anything within this this circle, so that includes anything underneath the town center, on the berries here, and on the gold, mm -hmm. is going to receive that boost. And it looks like Ducky is just going straight for Fast Castle. That's what this Aachen signifies. That's what this tower signifies. Yeah, just going that's on the plan. Gold. If we need more food, we can grab the berry bushes. That's that's the plan here. Mm -hmm. And what's the plan for the English? Well, of course, Council Hall, because you, you don't really have much choice as the English. The other landmark isn't that great. 
Yeah, it's Council Hall, and we also also see a barracks com, uh, <coughs> party coming, coming up. up straight away. Yeah, th so that means that the English aren't just looking to it's, go to Castaways. It's not an option for the English to just allow the Holy Roman Empire to do their thing. No, because bec it's going to be castle, mm -hmm. and then it's going to be prelates. Yeah, kept picking relics, up relics, yes. and then there's going to be a lot of gold in the pocket of the Holy Roman Empire for free for to make uh, men at arms and mm -hmm. and knights with and you don't want yes. that so we want to be there before that is going to happen we, we need to at least hope to get uh, some sort of map control yeah. and possibly slow things yeah. down especially so take either, away the gold either stop them from going with castle at all or stop them from getting the getting the relics by defending the relics stopping them from going castle is not going to happen no yeah, they're they're gonna go cast, and they're pretty fast in it too. Yeah, like they're almost already there, yeah. right? And we barely have any units out, and that's not mm -hmm. that's not because Artemis is slow or anything. No, I mean um, she could have moved some of these over the on, on on the other side of the map already, but it it wouldn't have done anything. Of course, he's a little bit slower because he has farms instead of like collecting from the sheep. However, that should not be that big of a difference. I do not know that the farms are. I mean, she's slower. She's yeah. wasting but resources. Yeah, on in them, a so. sense, like you're you're taking a loan out on that yeah. early, but no, there's no stopping this, right? Yeah, no. you can't typically um, on on maps. Sorry, stop the Holy Roman Empire from. From going castle, like unless it's like a very small map. There, there are a couple ones that like just like have a ring of, of mm -hmm. forest or or a ring of mountains around the uh, the side. We do and need to call the micro police here though, because there needs to be a meal at those berry bushes. Thank you. <laughs> it's it's just because we were only interested in getting up as fast as you can, and now mm -hmm. we want, um, <laughs> we wanted the mill a little bit closer because we could. It's gonna be a burgrave. And this is really interesting. That that means that they want to be aggressive in Castle Age. For yeah. sure. Because we can can make a lot of units, uh, I believe, men at arms. Okay? We can make... It's basically a barracks. It's basically a barracks. So you can make spearmen from it. You can make uh, lance connect from it. And you can make men at arms from it. I, there's going to be one person watching this thinking you're American and being able to pronounce lance connect. Uh, he's also Nim is also Dutch. <laughs> he just sounds like an American. He's just got the perfect ex accent. <laughs> That's the reason why he can't pronounce this uh, fluently. Oh yeah, so we're getting the the Burgrave Palace. Um, expect to see men at arms coming out of this because yeah. what it's what's Artemis is going to do against this? Uh, I mean, you would say crossbows, but we can't make the crossbows. You can't yet make until those until no. she is castle age. I I think I would have liked to to see those those longbows. Harassing the gold already. Mm -hmm. I know. Because we're already right now. Can we? They're they're up top check? here. I, I I do believe. They're just standing still. Yeah, and it seems like Artemis is thinking more long term, mm -hmm. and is thinking, well, I I think I might just gonna try and deny wood maybe. Mm -hmm. But I would love to see some moves from Artemis, right? Because she she did invest into this. Yeah, we need to we need to use the things. Otherwise, we're we're basically. We're, we're paying rent for something that we don't have yet. We, we can we can walls are coming up. We can invest that money instead of like putting it on yeah, the savings account. Yeah, basically anything you, that you you pay for in this game, right? Mm -hmm. Or even things that you do not pay for, it's an investment, right? You've got like uh, these costs that you could be using for something else. If you're investing it in an army and not into, say, economic resources, <laughs> oh, <hello. laughs> this, this is... Probably going to go build a tower? Oh, no, just... Ah, so we don't use the bowmen to harass... No, 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 no. We use a villager. We are English. We use our villagers to harass yep. enemy villagers. <laughs> I mean, it seems to be working. Um... <laughs> the villager might go down though. <laughs> Artemis has decided to go for a second TC mm -hmm. instead, and um, there's a good chance that on on the 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 Egypt we'll get a third TC even. Mm. I'm I'm confused. So I thought this was gonna go differently. I I thought like the Burgrave, we are gonna be 
Okay, we might still be going for this. <laughs> there are some on the map. Yeah, yeah, I would, like, no, I know that we have men at arms. Mm -hmm. I'm just, I was worried that um, we weren't actually going in and harassing the English now, because, mm -hmm. let's be honest, the Artemis' time to stop this from happening has yeah. passed. Yeah. She hasn't denied gold. She hasn't denied the the Egypt. Again, the, the Egypt was probably never going to happen. Mm -hmm. the, uh, sorry, the... Denying the Egypt was probably never going to happen in the first place. But now she lost the map control when it's time for Ducky to actually pick up all those relics. Yeah. And um, typically what I do, I th I think I would still do this right now, honestly, is um, in the Aachen Chapel, we have that first prelate, the one that we yeah. start the game with. Right? Just sitting there. I would I would take that out of the, the Aachen Chapel. Send it, send it on its way already. Go, go pick up the the, the relics already. Mm -hmm. um, just as you're aging up. Uh, you I know. Can also I know. Decide to like have the new one go in the Arkham Chapel again if you don't feel comfortable not having one in there. Yeah, but it's just like it's so valuable, right? And Artemis is clearly not going to be in Castle faster than you, and you need those relics mm -hmm. uh, because even if you get the Burgrave, right, and not the Regnitz Cathedral, which offers you twice the amount of gold for those relics, there's still a really good idea. Yeah. Because you can put them in keeps, and you can put them in outposts. Yeah, you can use them to set fencefully, and, and also... They, they are them. incredibly yeah. useful uh, defensively, because they they just make those outposts and those keeps so much stronger. Mm -hmm. um, so it's going to be a white tower. Not, I like this not a big surprise. I like, yeah, I didn't think they were going to go for uh, <laughs> King's Palace either. I, I expect the White Tower here. Mm -hmm. um, but it's, it, this is a very defensive position. These farms, you're not getting on, <laughs> no. any, on these. But there, there are no villagers on it. I mean, there's two on it, I think. Yeah. They're probably Artemis, making Artemis just knows, right I need that White Tower up. Yeah. And now I can start making crossbowmen. Yeah, both from the help. Council Hall they're gonna help as well as the time. White Tower. Yeah, because we need we need to, those men at arms to be dead. <laughs> and I wonder what what the plan here is is for um for duck mm -hmm. Like, what are we doing from from this point on? Yeah, because our enemy has a counter. It's it's a little bit strange to me because I expected both of these to to be more aggressive than they have been. Mm -hmm. I expected the English to um to try and and at least harass the gold villagers yeah and i expected duckade with with the burgrave to do a real man-at-arms push here mm -hmm. right to to worm her way onto those yes yeah, she seems those to be farms scared. to do some real economic damage she seems to be scared to pushing these in and I, right now i and get I, it I think might be because he just she wants to get those those prelates out and grab those relics and don't lose her army while that's happening. I think that is probably what she's thinking right now. She's just thinking, maybe I can just grab the wallet. But she does know that there is a second town center mm -hmm. in the game. Yeah, which puts the time li limit on decade. But I, like, I'm just, I'm just a little confused, really. Maybe I'm wrong about this, and maybe um, it would have gone terrible for Artemis had she just lost her, her longbowman over here, mm -hmm. or uh, terrible for decade if she sacrifice some men at arms to kill some villagers maybe maybe i'm wrong about it but it's it is what i would have expected to happen yeah, if you guys have a different view on things we're saying in the game definitely let us know in the comments we love to you know get your input in what you would do it's just what i thought was the strategically sound mm -hmm. option um but there is you know there's also some predictability in in that and and perhaps trying to be unpredictable <laughs> is not a bad idea in I a mean, tournament it's, a, it's the same with like chess right chess is pretty straightforward for what you can do but a lot of people have different thoughts about like what strategy you could do against a certain board and i think that's the same with age vampires like there's things that a lot of people would do and things that are proven to be working well but sometimes just I don't know, bringing all your villager forward to put a keep down can work in your favor. It doesn't have to go wrong. Yeah, no, we're com just completely walling this farm in. Um, we've got the monastery out too. That's, by the way... Uh, that's a bit too late. It's too <laughs> for, late. Uh, for the relics. Because those are five relics mm -hmm. coming in. Yeah. 
three of them being carried in right now. Yeah, two of them already in the monasteries over yeah, here. Yeah, and two of them already in the base. I, <laughs> so, I don't know why we're not putting anyone in, in the outpost. Yeah, because we could have it anywhere. I, yeah, it doesn't matter where you put them. For the people who uh, make this mistake, because like I've I've seen some people do this, that mm -hmm. they think that they need when they have the regnants. We have the bird grave this, this time around, but when we have the regnants, it boosts the income of all relics that are in your buildings. It doesn't matter where you put them, and you don't need them in the regnants. Yeah, so you can just put them anywhere else, which is probably better. This, so. this has happened before. I'm getting a, a sense of deja vu here. Oh, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> There's only eight villages um, capable of uh, collecting from a corpse. Yeah, so we've we've only got eight on this uh, this board, mm -hmm. um, but it, I suppose it makes sense to bring out more villagers so that you're not too busy microing uh, your villagers back and forth and saving the one that would mm -hmm. otherwise get gored by by the board. Gored by the board. Yeah. Um, that, that almost it's just, sounds like it's a just thing. less it's just less micro intensive that way. Yeah. Duckade is thinking. Five, five relics? That is not enough gold for no. me, actually. I mean, Duckade is like on 11 village or 10 village now on gold. Okay, getting all the village of gold. I mean, 2k gold. That is not it's enough gold for me. I need the sacred sites on top of it. I mean, it's not a bad idea. Like, th those prelates are not doing anything. Yeah, I'm, I'm concerned, <laughs> though, because Duckade's army, um, although mm -hmm. it is like a little bit more is clearly countered by the uh the crossbow and if i'm not mistaken right now um do we have a blacksmith up and we're going uh, swabia yeah, already left. yes so um love to see some more upgrades coming in for army like more damage there used to be a tech here called forced march which mm -hmm. didn't cost you a lot honestly mm -hmm. um, but it it is absolutely vital to the holy roman empire um, when you take it, your infantry moves faster. Mm. And this is really good, especially for the man at arms. Yeah, so somewhat the, the unit of choice of the Holy Roman Empire. Mm -hmm. And um, having that slow moving, heavily armored unit moving faster is so nice. And I mm -hmm. think in the most recent update, if I'm not mistaken, um, they just made that a, a regular part of the Holy Roman Empire as a whole. Oh, nice. So it's no longer a technology. It's just standard, um, a standard part of the Holy Roman Empire. We see plus one range damage coming in for Artemis the English. And on uh, Duck 8's side, we have veterancy for horsemen, fertilization and upgrades for the men-at-arms to elite which is logical because we've been pumping out like a lot of men at arms. And I like this. I like going for both horsemen and men at arms instead of saying like, well, these spearmen, mm -hmm. I want archers for those. I don't, I don't care about the archers, right? Because the horsemen, the horsemen do extra damage versus range units. Mm -hmm. And our biggest problem are these crossbowmen yeah. right now. But we've also, um, we've also got uh, like a lot of melee units already so it's easy to just go into bloomery mm -hmm. and upgrade the damage of all your units and there's another uh, upgrade coming in now uh, it's time barns where yeah. the relics will give um it's plus 40 wood plus 40 wood and 10 stone it used to be i think it used to be yeah so that stone. times five times five yeah it's a lot of extra income and um i'm very happy to see that technology picked up Decapping is happening. Yeah, Artemis is thinking, not nah, not gonna let that happen. <laughs> Too much gold. She's putting outposts on the the far ends of it so mm -hmm. that she kind of knows what's going on nearby. But also, if there's gonna be a fight there, she's gonna have the English bonus from being close to a yeah. an outpost. Yeah, she's not putting them right next to the sacred site because she doesn't really care about that. She just wants to know what's going on and be able to to fight on it without mm -hmm. having to replace. The outpost here. She's got like a whole line of outposts going on in the middle, so she can definitely see when there is an enemy coming. So this is a lot of line of sight for, mm -hmm. for Artemis, whereas Duckade doesn't see anything. No. I mean, we don't even have a scout army. out for Duckade, and that's it's terrifying, honestly. Yeah. I'm, I'm very <laughs> afraid to lose those villages. I mean, I shouldn't be. What are we doing? What's happening here? Oh. 
Seems like we're sending guys in one by one. Yeah, we are here. trying to place them over here, oh. but th there is no door here, so they're moving around. Oh no, that's that's sad. Always gotta love the pathing if you don't see that. Yeah, <laughs> that uh, but no again, way. this is dangerous though because Duck Aid cannot afford to lose all of her army here. Yeah, they will get a free base push. <laughs> there go all the prelates too. I think I would rather keep those prelates, just put them on my wood line. Mm -hmm. Just have them buffing up my, my villagers there. Nope, no prelates. No prelates for us. <laughs> There's one more prelate, of course, but that one should... Yeah, that yeah, one's in, in the, the Arkham Chapel. Yeah, now, now we, we have a problem, though, because there is quite a big... Yeah, we can't, we can't keep doing this. We can't we keep trickling in units one by one and expecting them to, to live. We need to make sure that our rally point is a bit further away. We are we are losing so many units to this already. We're just giving them free kills. Because they, they die before they can do anything, right? Mm -hmm. In a group, they can at least start hitting them back, but... Yeah, at least one of them reaches it. Yeah. It's like uh, we, we all have to win together for it. <laughs> oh, we do see quite a big difference in the amount of income. Yeah. Take looking very, very strong in that regard. Mm -hmm. We've got the Manganel up, but there are um, not only men-at-arms out on the field now, but we are even making knights. I don't know where they are. <laughs> Here they are. They're, st they're, they're stuck. That's <laughs> fine. Uh, but we've got knights out as well, so those in can they come can in. Come. Yeah, they can come in and rush that Manganel, mm -hmm. and it's a real danger. I yeah. think I wouldn't have minded... You know, yeah, okay, we're, we are still making horsemen and still making men-at-arms, mm -hmm. but it's, I think it was just a mismanaged fight here and, and taking that fight way too early when we were not ready yet. Ooh, and this was, <laughs> this was also yeah. a long time coming. Duck 8 had no vision. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. That was so much forward. Yeah, I don't so know. Far. This was greedy. I, yeah. It's a good thing Artemis also is not paying attention. Also making farm there, like... <laughs> it's, it's a good thing Artemis is not paying attention here. Yeah. At least getting some villager kills in. <laughs> and we got five villager kills, six total. So and remember, we've got the, the Swabia up, so... Um, but we're not making anything out of Swabia. Oh no, we should be printing villagers. Okay, okay. good. <laughs> okay, okay, she heard us. Yeah, I think that's it's, it's all right. It's all right. It's interesting. Artemis is actually the one with the uh, the sacred sites now. Hmm. I don't know if I would have re revealed my hand here with the mangonel, but that's okay. Or can they? Can Artemis see that already? Anyway, probably not. No. No. We do have a problem with that wall, though. Then <laughs> that wall is definitely not closed anymore. Like we're not safe on that side. Well, we're not safe in any side anymore. Yeah, I do love all the towers coming out from Artemis. She can pick a fight at any position mm -hmm. and look to um, still get that bonus. Yeah, but she can definitely get those uh, berry villagers. I think we're also trying to move into... We've got our eye on Imperial. Mm -hmm. We've got our eye on Imperial. We have a lot of gold. Yeah, so you might be thinking about going Imperial and where is the, actually pushing yet. Where is the, the melee armor? Uh, sorry, the melee damage. damage. Not coming in. It's not looking. Together. Instead, we've got Elite Army Tactics, which is a fantastic mm -hmm. technology. It's a really good idea. Well, I also don't understand why Artemis isn't pushing those villagers here, because she can see. I mean, the ones on the berries, she can see clearly that they're just there on the berries. She has vision on that. Ooh. Okay. By <laughs> by Mangano. Uh, Mangano. Was it the Mangano? Uh, no, it was a. Uh, Trebuchet. Okay. Trebuchet. Yeah, we could. It's always a good idea to just refresh your lumber camps, guys. Mm. More alarms going off. Is Duckaid stressed? Is, is Duckaid stressed out here? Is that what we were feeling? Uh, I mean, like, is she is she a little bit overtaxed? Maybe too many things going on. Oh! Oh! Big Ooh. shots! That was a big shot. Big shots. And is Artemis gonna, is not paying attention. No, is she's she? not. She's just gonna let it happen again. Oh, oh no, 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 no. She's oh losing everything yeah. here. And also the trebuchet. The, this is pretty much evened up in a, in, mm -hmm. in a matter of a second. Yep. Thing is though that the villagers have no way to go really now. 
so she might get some villager. I don't think in. so. I don't no? think so. I don't no, think she can push in here. She There's might be these. getting some villager kills, but not but that she many. But she can, she can replace them with Swabia. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this, like, this again looks like stress building to me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right? At least not... Not, like, taking the time to put them This, this horseman was just... Doomed from the start. Hey, he was, he was a little bit special. <laughs> Didn't quite know where to go. But no, Duck 8 is going to clean this up, and mm -hmm. after that... We need to see Duckade going for the sacred sites, right? Mm -hmm. To contest them, to take them away from Artemis, and perhaps yeah. even go for that, um, that go for that push again that we we were hoping for in the in the in the start of the game. Yeah. Do you think that Duckade needs to defend herself a little bit more with balls? Um, I think at this point, right, the the favor is going to swing in like the balance of power is going to mm -hmm. swing in, 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 in Duckade's favor. Yeah. Right. She's got more units out on the map, better units out on the map, mm -hmm. um, more, a, a, a far higher income, more villagers, etc. cetera. Um, she needs to clean up outposts. She needs to clean up the sacred sites. She's doing that. This yeah. one's being taken out at least. Uh, I think we're moving over to this one. This one's probably a little bit, uh, protected. Oh, we're getting stonewall <laughs> Stone tower. towers. Oh my God, guys, they're back. They're back! <laughs> we, we've seen them before, but I was in a bronze game. Yeah, it's it's so rare to see stone wall towers being used. And they used them quite quite a bit. <laughs> it was a sight to be seen. Okay, Forward keep trying. I don't think that forward keep is gonna come up. Um, this one? It's for decade. Uh, oh, yeah. It's for Holy Roman Empire. Player. Oh, yeah, they're gonna run. <laughs> I thought there were just a couple of units there for Duckade, and she sent the I other was just ones about to say, else. I think we need more farms, Duckade. I think we need more farms. Oh, it, it, it's, hurt my, it's hurting my eyes that they're not, you know, neatly placed, but I yeah, also understand well, that sometimes you don't have not, the time for it's, it. It's like this leaves room for irrigation in in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, some nice, some nice, you know. This this keep rivers. is coming up though. Yeah, yeah. Duck yeah, it's, was it's coming up. wanted yep. to make very, very sure that that keep was coming up. Now this sacred side is gonna be uh, falling as well. We've got uh, biology coming in as well. Low for the horses. Yeah, so for for our twelve horsemen and for our knights, mm -hmm. those are gonna all be buffed up with extra. And is extra that another veteran HP. too? The first one. This one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the elite yeah. Uh, knights. Elite knights. Elite knights, yeah. Wait, why are they called elite for the knights, but veteran for the other things? No, veteran is. Uh, it depends on um, if you have like a dark age unit or. Mm. Um, so if it's, if it's if it, it exists in dark age and then you know has to have a feudal counterpart, it's yeah. it's a uh, hardened, like the hardened mm -hmm. spearman, for example. Yeah. And then if it's Castle Age, it's Veteran. And then if it's Imperial, it's Elite. Okay. So it's just after Veteran. Yeah. Reinforced defenses. I, I like these, but I don't know. I don't know why we don't have Bloomery. Yeah. We, we, we need Bloomery. We, we have an all melee army. But right? like, just a, a quite a lack of upgrades for the army. Like the only thing we have is ranged armor. But if you look at Artemis, Artemis has got like level two of everything already. This mangonel does not need to be focusing that other mangonel. It needs to be focusing the crossbow now. Good dodge, good dodge from Artemis there. It's not going to be a second time. We are going to lose our our bomber here. We mm -hmm. we've lost a lot of siege actually from Duckade. I think just poor management of of uh, of the army here. We kind of lost. We kind of lost the control of our of our things here, because that I feel like that fight was definitely in, in Duckade's favor, mm -hmm. and it definitely swinged the favor back to the English, because the English seems to have more control now. Um, but obviously, Duckade put that keep here in the middle, meaning that it's going to be hard for Artemis to get that sacred type back, making it harder for a sacred type victory, especially if two of them. Get keeped. Barkshire. 
coming up for Artemis. Where are we putting that down? Where are we put? Okay. Okay. This makes sense. I kind think. of defensive. This makes sense. It's the defensive one. Um, the question is, should we have put it a little bit more forward? Not it's, that far, but like it's uh, tricky. somewhere here. It's tricky. Um, I think if you put it here, mm -hmm. right, instead of where it is, it still opens up this this side of the, the, the flank, which we know is also in, in the hands of Duckett. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can definitely... Oil and oil. Yeah, Wedge nice. rivets, but no bloomery. No, it's yeah. not that. It's not that expensive. No, it's just a feudal age. Can we get bloomery? Elite and Donsknecht. Yeah, we do protect all those wood lines with this uh, this Berkshire, so that's definitely gonna be easier for the English because we we love some wood as the English. Okay, I think as we stand right now. Mm -hmm. The game has reached a pretty good balance, right? Neither Ducket nor Artemis is really hurting right here. Yeah. Right? They've not managed to hurt each other all that much. No. It comes down instead, maybe, because I think this game is going to go on for a bit. Yeah. Right? Because this is this is not going to end anytime soon. Like, neither of these are, are really making any, any headway into mm -hmm. Artemis' thought, hmm, Research. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> she just queued up. Uh, was that seven re uh, researches? Enclosures. Um, and I, I wonder if that's if it's gonna come down to that, right? If it, if it's gonna come down to uh, you know how much gold is gonna be left on the map after this? Yeah. Because wisely, Ducket is is grabbing this gold already. Mm-hmm. She has this gold still in the back. Yes, yeah, she has got map control on that side, so she's already grabbing and it. And if she manages to push her way into this and take this away from mm -hmm. Artemis, things things can look very, very dire for Artemis. Uh, but if we are just going to let this run out, mm -hmm. right? And clearly Duckett's army costs far more gold than Artemis's does. Yeah, but the thing is Artemis has all the upgrades. Um, I, I'm really wondering... Oh, is it Bloomery? We've got Bloomery coming in. It's... It is now that our half our army is, is hand cannoneers that we think, hmm, Bloomery might also be nice. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, but, like, then it comes down to... Uh, uh, Artemis... Artemis very wisely thinks, I need to protect this gold thing. Yeah. No, I'm gonna lose that gold. I, I, I can't lose that gold. Um, no, but it's it's like when the gold runs out, mm -hmm. right? Who's gonna win? Is it English farms with the the enclosures, mm -hmm. or is it relic. is it the HRE with five relics? Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Because again, we don't have regnets, right? These are yeah. these are not. Um, the HRE relics you would otherwise have. In fact, no, I think, boosted. if I'm if I'm honest, Burgrave was a mistake. Yeah, we we, we, we did not get any value out of Burgrave. Oh no 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 no. That was one HP. One Are HP. we bringing in more villagers? Okay, tell me that we're sending more villagers. Otherwise, we need to cancel it. Otherwise, we're losing all those resources. Is it We need to cancel it now then, because that bomber yeah. is gonna keep hurting our keep. And, and keep losing, keep losing the resources. You only get the resources back uh, depending on how much health it has, right? You know what I spotted? I spotted a pink trader. A trader. A pink trader. It is a trader, but again, she's gonna lose this position mm -hmm. and lose this big gold. Yep. Which that is, if Duckade realizes <laughs> what is going on here. I'm not sure uh, that that bomber is definitely gonna die. Artemis definitely loves those upgrades. Some more veteran coming in. Veteran archers, yeah, longbowmen and veteran crossbowmen. Mm -hmm. You see that she's been keeping up quite well with all the upgrades. She's almost got everything. Yeah, it's it's baffling to me how. Um how 
like we've lost we've lost a lot of villages, but we can replace these. But I mm-hmm. think we're just we're like we're not pop capped, right? No. Like why why are we just not printing more yeah, villagers? Yeah. Has a cute one? No. No. Yeah, we could definitely make some more villagers. We could stand making some more villagers. Oh, 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 oh. my God, Simon! This is Artemis so is not gonna get a notification for the wall being attacked if if she just depletes all this the stone. Then that she wall can go is gonna true. come down. But uh, Artemis is not gonna know unless yeah. he looks at the map and sees that there is some blue duck next to her wall. So she's not gonna notice. I think in order to keep keep Artemis from noticing at all, you want to keep her busy. Yeah. You want to keep her busy. You want to you want to just send units to different places and look like you're really threatening to do something, but mm-hmm. not actually do something. <laughs> this cave needs to be repaired. Oh, yeah. It needs to be repaired. We see, I think they're going to collapse again with the armies. Why are we not up to pop cap ducking? Yeah, we do have this like This is such AK, a mistake though, isn't it? AK food in the bank. And also, I love to see some more upgrades coming in for the army. Gunpowder, ranged armor. But I don't know why we are not replenishing our numbers because Artemis says, I'm fighting and yep. I'm making 15 horsemen mm-hmm. and five spearmen yep. in this fight. This fight is going very, very, very well for decade though. Yeah, and I think... The Lons Connect really doing yeah. work. And I see Artemis is getting... Uh, I think it was Roller Sugar, Sugar Triggers, I saw come in. Uh, this is this is Shrapnel, like Shattering No, the one projectors. that looks like uh, a waffle. Is this a waffle? No, no, no. It's already gone from this sheet. Okay. It looked like a waffle. Uh, let's see if we can find ourselves it's a... a si- it's in a siege workshop. I, I know, but I'm looking for where we can find a siege workshop. <laughs> Siege workshop, where are you? Here they are. No, this is Relish Shutter Church. Oh, what's the waffle then? I don't know what you mean by waffle. <laughs> Guys, leave in the comments. What 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 upgrade is the waffle? <laughs> if you know, you know. <laughs> oh! Oh, you know? Oh, yes, I do know what you mean. <laughs> the waffle. Oh, um, it adds extra health to trebuchets and rams, I think. Mm. Because they eat waffles. Yeah, because they're supplied with waffles and it's just, mm-hmm. it just like, you know, waffles. Wait, is there a Randy there? A what? A Rebaldequin. A Rebaldequin? Yeah, they're a little bit. Yep, yeah, yeah. There is a Rebaldequin. I feel like we need to defend our bomber a little better. Oh, oh, oh. Artemis noticed the. A sneaky, sneaky play in the West. She did notice. <laughs> she did notice. <laughs> Caught that out before it really could hurt her. Because it's also like this also threatens her trade, right? Mm-hmm. How many traders yep. do we have? We have 16 active traders, and that's a lot. 17. Yes. Yeah, so if we put in, traders. does this decade know? I can't. Like she, she's got to know, right? No, I'm not sure. She's got to know. They're right here. They're right here. Yeah, and the stuff. Oh, there, yeah. she, there they are. Traders. I don't know if she noticed now though, because they were just there for like. Traders. Yeah. They need to be stopped, Duck Eight. <laughs> Go in. <laughs> I don't know what is up with with the bombard being so exposed all the time. Mm-hmm. Like, the bombard just doesn't appreciate. Being in groups, you just like. It's a alone. solitary animal. Yeah, he's an introvert. <laughs> With a Rebolda Yeah, or? the positioning of this cliff here makes this very, very <laughs> difficult for Ducky to to fight in this this way, and she's lost all of her siege. Mm-hmm. I think there was another bombard. Yeah, okay, oh, there they are. More. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, that Rebolda needs three, to go right. because it's gonna tear through these. Mm-hmm. Put. Again. Yeah, we need to queue things okay. faster. We, we do have a lot of food. We we took that first fight, right? Uh-huh. 200 versus 175. Yeah. Yeah. 
I feel like we've barely replenished our numbers since mm -hmm. then. What is going on? We have... We need more production buildings. We what have the moon? resources for yep. this. I don't I don't care what you're you're making, but we can't allow <laughs> this to happen, right? Yeah, like these we can't, city villages or military doesn't really Like matter. we're basically on half military strength. Mm hmm I do see that there is quite a lot of uh, upgrades that have come true now for the military, so I'm glad to see that you know that coming in because it's gonna be it's gonna be an uphill battle fighting an army that does have all the upgrades in. Artemis Things that she's done with her siege. Yeah, she, she also has anymore. some introvert bombard. Introvert. Or maybe these are extrovert because they were trying to make friends. They were trying to make friends. <laughs> <laughs> they were trying to say hi to a group of people. And then they, they ended up not being so nice. <laughs> yeah, that happens all the time, guys. Sometimes if you say hi to people, they're not, that, they're, they're not in your best interest. We do, like... At least horsemen, right? Like, we know mm -hmm. that we have stables. At least horsemen. We can make horsemen. Yeah. Okay, this is this is really good. I mean, it, it will be really good, but mm -hmm. Artemis is on, on a lot of economic units here. True. And true. I think a lot of those are going to be traders. Okay, now it's still 17. Seven. Still 17. But she does replenish really quickly because she's almost full to... Well, there she is. 200 again. Yeah, she is actually... Building up to, I think that's a very important lesson from this. We need to be building up to pop cap. Mm -hmm. We need to be building up to pop cap. And we cannot keep allowing this to happen because every time we we go into a fight with with less population space, we are fighting less efficiently. Yeah. Right. We are trading resources less efficiently. Yeah, we're ba basically giving them an advantage. And like, if you're fighting with two against three, the three are not gonna come up with just a little bit, but they're gonna come up a lot more because if you have a bigger group, they're gonna win harder in a sense. Yeah, and here we see the horsemen going in for the siege straight away, mm -hmm. um, just taken out in a second. There's no nothing that she can do to stop this. The rewall came up though, and uh, there's. Yeah, Not much the HRE though. needs to find yeah, find no. a way into this to stop this trade, I think, from going on. Because it's the enclosures and trade that are the only thing that are going to keep... Um, I mean, that's going to keep getting the gold in for Artemis. Yeah, it's gonna, just going to keep the gold coming in for Artemis. I'm wondering if she even has somebody on gold right now. And look at this, right? Yeah. And this is HRE, right? Like, mm -hmm. she would love to make um, more gold units. There are some traders, though, as We've well. got seven... Hey, These two are so well matched. <laughs> <laughs> we just both go for 17 traders. We'll agree on 17 traders and call it a day, guys. <laughs> it's like it was in the tournament rules. You can only make 17 traders. That's the max. Can we take a look at uh, how many... So this is the production mm -hmm. for the English player. And this is the production... Sorry. For the HRE player. I think we have a lot less production for yep. HRE. Yeah. And it's that's probably why a duck egg cannot replenish as, as quickly as Artemis does. We we need more more barracks. We need more stables. I think stables especially would be a very good idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we have quite some food coming in. We've got food and we've got wood. And there's still plenty of there's still plenty of yeah. wood on the map, right? Plenty of wood. It's not prairie. I always love that as the English. <laughs> there's no, there's no mood anymore. If there's one thing that's also very strange is that HRE has not picked up specialized pick, mm. right? And all the gold is almost already gone. Well, now it's, <laughs> now it's whatever. <laughs> okay, some more upgrades coming in, the, uh, more veterancies for uh, let's see, archers. And we've got veterancy for horsemen coming in. And for decades, we do have uh, incendiary incendiary arrows. I can't pronounce that for some reason, but incendiary. Firing, firing arrows. <laughs> All right. Uh, some bombards trying to destroy wall. And uh, I mean, that's the only way we're going to get through there. I get so nervous when I see this. I get so nervous when I see these bombards all the way up here alone again. Yeah. Yeah, they, 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 like I say, 
it's okay to just have some introvert bombards. They they like being alone, you know. This is what this is what no, this is what we need to see, right? Oh no, get get the traders. The traders. It needs to be stopped. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they I think she's going for it. Okay. Okay. Oh, That's where did the trader go? Because Artemis <laughs> Artemis has got three thousand in the bank. Mm -hmm. Right? Three thousand gold. She can that, it'll, it'll last her for a bit. And Counters. on top of that, um we've got the enclosure still behind mm -hmm. them, right? Like it, yeah. it's gonna last for for a little while. She's gonna keep getting quite some gold here. I wish we had emergency repairs up here. That keep is gonna go down because, because we can't really do anything about the trebuchets because they're behind the wall. Yeah, I just wish we had emergency repairs up here. That would that would fix us up straight away. So how can we get it up here? Just with a new, another town center? You would need um, you would need to to have it be in the influence zone of the town center. Yeah. Or just make a little like production buildings towards this place. That would also work. But it's a little bit hard to do that over the walls. Mm -hmm. This is good though. This is good. Because even if even if this gets cleaned up mm -hmm. by Artemis and a lot of these units are, are basically to have health, right? Yeah. Boiling oil just raining down on, on, on top of these guys. Mm -hmm. uh, there's more keeps down here. Yeah. Yeah. The Artemis is not going to be shape. able to push in because there's, there's stone walls. Oh, oh. It's, it's, it's the sniper. It's the sniper trebuchet. In, on the introvert bombards. Well, well, it's on, it's on, sometimes still, things are hard to say. Introvert we're bombard. We're yeah. still not not up to... to our, like, our armies are still not up to stuff. Another thing I noticed is Artemis hasn't got like the second upgrade from fertilization yet either. Assuming that Artemis has... Oh, this one, you mean? Yeah, quite yeah, some farms right now. Can um, we check on that? She doesn't need it. Because you can look at how much food she has already. Mm -hmm. These are, are English uh, farms, right? So they yeah. already boost the, the, the food income. She doesn't need it. She doesn't need it. Look at the look at the food that she's got, right? Like, she can make more farms. And if she does, she will do it because of enclosures to get more gold in. <laughs> but we but can not, always not sell. Not for the food. We can always sell the food. Yeah, it's just, it's expensive. It's like, it, especially the third tier, it's an expensive pick. Okay, the wall's been broken up. And those trebuchets are gonna go down because the horsemen are coming through. But the horsemen can't really go anywhere right now, so they're. No, but that's another. That's a lot of money down the drain again. Yeah. And we've got the Barkshire, right? We've got the Barkshire for the English, not the um, mm -hmm. not the Wingard Palace. So those aren't tre uh, cheap trebuchets. No. Full price. Full price trebuchets. That's a thousand resources, if I'm not mistaken. We 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 know that these are here. <laughs> They're not a thousand resources anymore. I'm sorry. I was mistaken. It's 550. They used to be a thousand. Can you imagine? Back in the days. Back in the days, there used to be a thousand resources. <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, we're gonna get some counter attack for the attack. How many traders left? Oh Thanks. my god. 36! Duckade. How, how many does Duckade have? 30. <laughs> what? No <laughs> way! No way! How are you guys doing this? How does this keep happening? <laughs> what is this? Do you guys just agree on this stuff or what's what's going on here? I'm making one trader. Okay, I'm making one too. <laughs> that's 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 fair, girl. You do you, I'm gonna make another one too then. <laughs> uh <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> But yeah, uh, let's 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 take a look. What do you think uh, is the victory for the English going to look like right now? What would you well, do? Well, the victory for HRE stuff? will just be build up to pop cap, mm -hmm. build up to pop cap and win. Yeah. Because that's that's why these are like she's winning fights, right? Like her army is good. Yeah. It's good. She's got the position too. I love her position here, right? Mm -hmm. Like it's 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 great to keep here, to keep here. She's got plenty of sight. She know every, she knows everything that's going on. She knows that there's trade here, and she has punished it a little bit. Um, but just build up the pocket, yes. And this this is this is this is the strangest thing, right? Because like this was the closest she's got to pop cap, yeah. I think, and it's mid fight. <laughs> yeah. It's mid fight. So at least he's replenishing right now. Because look at that. Look at how yeah, these are dropping. No, no, she's more pop than dropping Artemis like flies. Has. These crossbowmen do not stand a chance 
against the horde that is coming our way. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, but what would be the victory condition for the English right now? That, just, you know, that's what, that was what I was asking. That that bomber wanted to make very sure it didn't miss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and died of the boiling oil. <laughs> um, okay, the victory condition for the English. Well, I mean, it's yeah. What what is it? I suppose it's to to stop the the HRE farming economy if you can. Right, if mm -hmm. you if you deny a chapel, or if you are able to deny relics, it seems yeah. a little bit unlikely. It's it's hard to reach right now. But we have seen that the the English is on the defense for quite a bit right now, and it hasn't been able to like make bombards to attack. If if I'm really honest, it's case. stopping trade for either one of them. Mm -hmm. It's stopping trade. If you stop trade, um, they you're not gonna win fights anymore. Yeah. No. If we if we only like had like a, a town center here, right? Mm -hmm. Get the we could have we could have yep. kept all three of these keeps up. Yep. Or just so, some some buildings that connected. Yeah, it seems like oh. Artemis really wants to get all the keeps down. Multiple angle attack. What's especially a shame is that um, HRE has Culverin. Mm. Has Culverin. And Culverin's countered the bombard. Yeah, v very much so. This is the first time we see Artemis actually fighting against like the walls. Of yeah, I mean, the she was at the, the, the walls here earlier, but it looks like she's... There's a... a not again. Again. We, we lose, so we like lose so hi. many siege units to... Extroverted bombards. <laughs> It's 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 hard to say that it's just not a it's not a mistake, right? Like, mm -hmm. and I know, right? Like, your siege is so so squishy. You're it's so able to too. lose it so easily. Mm -hmm. Manganel upgrade for both of them <laughs> oh again. My. You guys are these twins. guys are so <laughs> well matched. <laughs> twins down here. If only I'm we had it. wood you in a safe DNA position test. in our base. <laughs> Duck it. DNA test incoming, I swear. <laughs> yeah, we s I think that the raid's already cleaned up again with the... Uh, and they're both at 200 now, right? Like, they, they're yep. both pumping out units. She's got 71 elite men-at-arms on the field, but there is 48 crossbowmen. <laughs> How are you going to take those down if not uh, for, for a manganel? And yeah. they're on the way. Mm -hmm. I would imagine yeah. so, at least. They're on their way. <laughs> Somewhere. How, how is it the, the trader town right yeah, now? Yeah, the traders The traders have gone down on this side. Yeah, so there's no way they're, they're even on the trader count anymore, right? I mean... I'm gonna... 42? Four, 42. No way! How does... How does this go? This, this doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense. What are you guys doing? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is going on there? That doesn't make any sense. Every time he checked in. <laughs> I swear, this is just a bug or something. Yeah, this is this is the weakest spot, probably, yeah. for um, the Holy Roman Empire's trade. There's not a lot of cover here. Uh, if she manages to move oh, in, yeah. oh, and she is. Oh, you should, what you happened should here? Just leave, yeah, leave that keep. Just walk outside of the range of the keep and then start And start all killing those. the traders. Yep. That might hurt. That might hurt quite a bit. We do have 10k gold in the bank though. There oh, did she close this gate? Oh no. Oh no, she's trading outside. Trade but now traders are getting killed on both sides. Traders are getting killed on both sides. Yeah, we know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> but but uh, Artemis's traders are taking the long way around. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here are all the um, the men at arms that we were fearing, right? So we've got all these these crossbowmen still. Where are they? Over here. Yeah, making their way right now. We have 108 villager kills on Artemis and 81 on. Duke. I don't know who's gonna win. No, I don't know who's gonna win this. It, it is quite a close match. It is quite a close match because, <laughs> honestly, right, really, mm -hmm. if Artemis manages to kill these traitors, finally, mm -hmm. right, nothing will have happened. Because look at Duckett's bank. Yeah. Nothing will have happened. Yep. She's banked so much gold. 
Mm -hmm. Right? Two holes like I said, the food economy is the one that yep. needs stopping. Yep. So she, she actually wants to like, have those horsemen go around all the way to the farms. Ideally, oh, oh, yes. There's, there's some going I mean, she can way. replace her, her villagers pretty easily, right? Like Duck Aid can. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'm looking at these right here. No, they're just turning around. <laughs> I mean, they're going for the, the crossbowmen. It's, it's, so. a, it's a good fight. Uh, this is a less optimal fight. Uh, but I, I don't... I think Artemis is running out of steam. Mm -hmm. I think Artemis is running on his team. We're almost an hour in, so at this point, they're both probably exhausted, right? They've Artemis both probably seen, anymore. looked at their siege, and saw them disappear, like, right at the moment that they clicked in mm -hmm. to try and save them still. Like, they're both exhausted. But Duckade has so much more in the bank. Duckade has a lot more in the bank. A lot more in the bank. And even if... Even if this food runs out... Mm -hmm. You, you can, can just buy, buy some, yeah. Just buy some food. Yep. It's it's cheap too. It's very cheap. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Where Artemis doesn't have much wood, doesn't have much gold. The thing that but Artemis, Artemis is still on the offensive. Yeah, and in the base, killing things. Hundred and thirty-one <laughs> villager kills. We've got another keep coming up. Okay, trying to. Trying to Artemis thinks I need some gold more gold and in, in, in some way you have gold Artemis. Yeah, it's just right here. I know I know it's not really defended right now, but you do have gold. You do have access to it. Mm -hmm. You can just roll back up. And I think okay. Artemis is on two TCs, right? Mm -hmm. So even if you lose some, it's it's okay, I think. But yeah, here we go. On the farms, horsemen on the it. farms. This might be. But it. we're battling up on the front as well. If the farm's gonna get hit, I mean that's that is the weak spot. Or, are we just running? Are we? Fast? Oh, I think we're gonna go. Are for we the going trade. for the farms? We're not going for farms. We're going for trade. But it's not. Then it doesn't matter. Then it doesn't matter what Artemis does here. Mm -hmm. We can put these up on the walls. That would be a very good idea. All right. Oh, we're going for the farms. Wait. What is going on? What is going on? Why is the pop cap for, for Duckade dropping so much? Mm. Is it still because we are on so very, very few production buildings? Yeah, I think so. Because Artemis is on 200 out of 200. Mm -hmm. This is not going well. No. We, we need some more production. Duckade has the resources to fix this. Yeah. But not the means of production. <laughs> And it seems like Artemis is killing more production, so it's going to be harder and harder if we don't immediately build back these... We needed to have more stables and more archer ranges and more, um, and more there's, barracks there's long, also not long ago. Cute. There's 20 units queued right now. And we only have 87 pops still left. I think this might be a for I can't believe this is happening because this is... This is just, like, we, we set it, like, halfway, right? And I don't think she's, like, since the 30-minute mark or so, I don't think she's added a single extra production building. No. And, again, if we take a look, right, at, um, at the English, look at that. That's 19, 19 stables yeah. alone already, right? And then we also have the council hall and, you know, GG. Congratulations to Artemis. That was... Quite quite a balanced match, if you ask me. If you want to see some more Age of Empires casted videos, click here on the screen. And we'll see you there.